You'll have to track down his couriers and destroy them along with their cargo. Excuse me? I'm hunting Karagaths on top of a Karagath? <laughs> oh, fuck me, this just got interesting, didn't it? Where do you think you're going, lad? Where do you think you're going? Oh! Oh, they're explosive! <laughs> Goodness gracious, great balls of fire! The couriers deliver the bursting powder. They will wreak unknown havoc. They're doing powder. Well, they're not doing powder. That would result in something quite different, wouldn't it? This is not good at all. Seriously, please. There you go, that's one. I'm running out of arrows. What do I do if I run out of arrows? Oh, you cheeky. What? Don't. What? Oh, yeah, I forgot these things can jump up. No, 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 no. No, you cheeky prick. You're not allowed to deliver it. Now I'm just going to wait for the other one to be miles behind. Good job, Forrest. <laughs> Forest run! A blasting powder could even make short work of the walls of Minas Ethel. Did he just say, if you don't make a fucking game about Minas Tirith and Helm's Deep at this point, I'm gonna slap a bitch, because that is a game you need to make with this. Oh, the worst thing imaginable just happened. I'm out of arrows. What do I do? Like, no, really, what do I do? I need a rock. Do I even need to jump on you? Got you! Uh, do you... The blood, the blood spray was just astounding there. The blood spray was amazing. Do I get an explosion if I do this? Oh no. Oh! You, you know when I saw you on the captain feed and saw you all small and spindly? I didn't think there was anything unique about you, but you... Ooh! I wasn't expecting that. I am really quite happy. I'm really quite surprised. Now I know why you didn't have any bodyguards. Hello, Ashcam. Utcha. You don't want to speak to me, my boy? Well, I've got to kill your beastie. That cat can be arranged. Well, or I can just uh, do that. That's just... Utch! Monster Slayer. Don't kill my bow. Fuck it, fine. I killed yours, it's only fair. Wow, how do you do? Oh, don't grab my fucking head of all the traits you could have had, you prick. There's nothing left between you and me now, is there? Good. I will carve you up and deliver your pieces to the corners of Mordor! Oh, fuck me, you're a man with a plan, aren't you? What's special about you, then? Because everybody else had something interesting about them. The last guy was immune to everything under the sun and his only weakness was his weapon. You, however, just seem to be rather healthy. Yeah, that's about it. You don't have anything interesting about you. I can literally just do this to you and I'll be completely fine. Oh, I almost feel bad. The last guy, the last two guys, in fact, held quite... Quite the record. The rule of men shall extinguish itself in a mighty blaze. You know, you're not too wrong. <laughs> you know, except for the part where we win in every shape, way, and form because Sauron's a fucking idiot. Who knows what catastrophes I've averted this day? Well, seeing as Helm's Deep still has blasting powder, and not as much as you'd think. Did his head just fade through that fucking wall? Is Pennywise underneath that goddamn cinder just grabbing heads? They all float down here, Georgie. They all float. In a minute he's gonna ask me if I want a fucking balloon. I've been dreaming up ways to cut you down. Allow me to show you a few. Zathra. That's a hell of a name. Ooch. Well, that was mildly inconvenient. For a moment, I thought you'd be a threat, you know, with the whole immune to range thing. If you were unable to be jumped over, you would have been quite the threat and problem. Maybe not a threat, just a pain in the ass, like a boil equaling me not be able to sit down. That's just mean. I underestimated this time. That you did, Mr. Fowl. Now, yeah. time for Toppy Bye Bye. Challenger! Challenger? Seems to me that one of us should be afraid. And it can't be me, so pucker up. Okay, now if that's not a fucking come on, I don't know what the hell is. Seriously. Pucker up? At least the other Oryx have the grace to at least mask it in some fancy fucking... Oh, you bastard. Oh, you're jumping toward me? Okay. <laughs> How'd that go for you? You seem to like jumping and we're right next to a bridge. You can probably guess where we're going. Oh. Insult to injury, your men are carving you up along the way to your fall. Fall from grace, fall from bravery, fall from a bridge. Oh. <laughs> Did you 
see the way he fell? <laughs> he kind of nutted himself right on the corner of the wood, and that's not something a man should say to another. Good gravy. Oh! Well, I just got introduced to that wall and your fear quite immediately. Where the fuck are you going? Stop trying to run! Seriously, it's for your own good, you gotta learn to face your fear head on! It'll do you the world of good! Assuming that thing, you know, stays alive for the time I get there and my captain isn't on his knees? I should probably hurry up. Hey there, Grelgy boy! Brought you a little meal, now eat it up. No, stop going for my guy. Hit the little shitty spindly prick. No, 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 but you can't go there. Stay right the flying fuck nuggets there. Kill him! Grog, I presented a meal to you. Grog, this is right there. I've offered him to you as the bloody idiots on Skull Island would present a whore to King Kong. Eat him! Oh, the man with the fear just ran straight into a Grog. Is he meaning to do that? Because he's done it twice now. He's, he's, he's this Grog dead, this Grog dead. Uh, um, is he? He is. Yes, he is. Oh, he's not dead. Oh, he's doing it again. Because... We can't win without the boss! Oh! Well, uh, there were many things about that. <laughs> the legend was immune to the Grog for whatever reason. He executed the captain that was trying to flee from the Grog inside the corpse of him, realised that I couldn't see half of it, and decided to do it again. Uh, <laughs> Okie dokie, you really are quite living up to your name of the legend. Thank you <laughs> for that. I've seen you a grand total of one time after our original encounter, and you've made it amazing. You've made it more than memorable. That's a story I'll tell my grandchildren. Let's see what you've got. So far, I'm not impressed. You're a shield master? So I shouldn't be actually af afraid of your weapon as you ground pound everyone to death. It is a bad day to be these guys. Seriously, stop doing the ground pound, motherfucker. It's an inconvenience for you more than me. You can do the ground pound if you want, please. What was that? What caught me out this time? Oh, you, you cheeky prick. Oh, oh what the freak? Man, die now. Will you get promotion? I can never get that timing these days. Never. What fucking happened to me? I used to be perfect at it, and now all of a sudden it's gone to shit and cinders! Oh, I'm like Gwyn. <laughs> Why? Of all the times you could have followed me, you chose this one! Who oh. look see it? Not believe it! Kill talk! I got killed by the dumb. You gotta be butchers and kidding me. Now's your time to make like Buzz Lightyear and believe you can fly. Your death is the price for those you enslaved. No. His death is the price for my death. Or did you forget that, you amnesiac brat? Have you lost count of how many times I've killed you? Let me remind you. Let me tell you what I have lost count of. The amount of times people have said that shit to me. Motherfucker, get some originality for Christ's sake. I've heard it at least a dozen times and every time I've had to retort with the same thing. You twat. Oh, fuck. Oh my, three for the price of one. He takes no prisoners literally because he kills them. Why won't this guy go down? Ach fuck. Oh, fuck, now I'm surrounded by ghouls and assholes. This is the last thing I needed. Oh. Are you fucking kidding me? I'm trying to deal with all the gore. Take the heat, Ranger. You will never best me. I don't know about that. I got you pretty goddamn close to death there. So I don't know what you're talking about with that arrogance. You were on death's doorstep, motherfucker. Aerosmith was singing a song for you. If you had any brains, you'd have stayed dead when I killed you last time. But you're dumb, ain't ya? No, that was the other guy I just killed. Why is everybody congregating around this area all of a sudden? One of your men just ran away, by the way. One of your men just fled the scene. You understand? I got a range of that. I was fucking six feet away! <gasps> Holy shit! That damage! That damage was just a little bit excessive, no hate of yours was procced, nothing, no, not a damnable thing, and yet somehow you did so much damage to me. Good lord. Oh no, roll, 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 What the fuck? 
You stop! Oh, what the? What the fuck? I thought he was about to fucking fall off with. Your stench is becoming familiar, maggot. Okay. Um. <laughs> Never mind the fact that when I accidentally tried to counter a grab, I stood there for two fucking whole seconds. <laughs> I thought he was gonna like military drop me fucking horizontally and just flop right the fuck off with me. What the fucking Baghdad dad was that? We both want to kill each other, so one of us will be dead. And I think it will be me. That kills you! Oh. Well, aren't you an astute one? We don't like each other. It's not like we were fucking bred to battle, you bloody fool. Whoa, 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 whoa. Put it down, flower, and piss off. <laughs> what the? Um? Yeah. I do love a good stomping. <laughs> Yeah, I don't know what a stomping is, but I certainly noticed your arrival when one of your own men got feathered with three flaming arrows! You're going down. Like, literally. You're gonna go down. Oh, hang on, actually, I can, abs I can, I can abuse this. That's it. You, my friend. I'm a master of nothing more than the mud of Mordor, you prick. Holy fucking shit, that does a lot of damage. I'll always find ya, you, you stupid shark. So, uh, <clears throat> just to clarify, we uh, we had a war chief with an automatic explosive launcher. Now we have a not so much war chief with an automatic flame thrower. Hmm, that's essentially what just happened there. I'm really beginning to hate my life. Ranger, go catch ya. Hope you're ready for a quick death. I've no taste for showmanship. You've no taste for showmanship? Then why are you wearing the fanciest of armor I've ever seen? And you've got a fucking dragon's tooth or weapon that's spiky. I mean, seriously, if you're not a showman, you're really fucking putting out the wrong vibes. Oh! Mr. Growlcatcher? I believe there's a job for you over here. Either the growl kills this brick or you catch him. This is either gonna be Pokemon or Impaler Man. I'm fine with either. There was no need for that. Oh, Jesus Christ! Right, oh, please, God. Are you in pain, maggot? Never mind. I can put an end to that. Can you please tell me why you keep hunting me down? This isn't fair. I came here to test the limits of a growl catcher. That's why I was here! Oh, God. I realized that was unblockable, I still fucking fell for it. You've got to- No! You motherfuckers, what is it? What, I've, oh, I'm almost certain this has happened before. Oh! You're not worth the nips who put in my blade. The range of your spears are fucking ridiculous! Oh, Jiminy, bastard and Jillicas. No, I'm not falling for it again. Okay, what the- is that an acidic Karagath just flying around? This fucking thing has got to fucking die! There you go. Mr. What? What? Twice now. What? You didn't learn the first time. What the fuck? I was. You've got to be fucking kidding me. I was no way near you. What the crime? Oh! Fuck off. Hope it's true, there's a reward for your head. He came back. I was a moment fucking done with the growl, and he comes back. Why does the biter insist on hunting me down? Do you want to know his position on the map? Let me tell you. Not there. Oh, the awkward moment where the war chiefs are over shadow of Mordor. A hundred percent. By the basic captains. And that's the end of the video. Thank you very much for watching.
If you enjoyed this video, then please do like it and maybe even share it with your friends. And should you find yourself wanting even more of it, then there's likely a playlist filled with even more of what you just watched. And you can always feel free to follow me on whatever social media you desire to stay ahead of the subboxes that typically lag behind. And hey, if you found yourself enjoying this more than you thought you would, then feel free to subscribe and check out anything else I've done in the past. So yeah, thanks again for watching all the way through to the end, and should you want to watch more of this, I guess I will see you in the next video. You'll have to track down his couriers and destroy them along with their cargo. Excuse me? I'm hunting Karagaths on top of a Karagath? <laughs> oh fuck me, this just got interesting, didn't it? Where do you think you're going, lad? Where do you think you're going? Oh! Oh, they're explosive! <laughs> Goodness gracious, great balls of fire! If the couriers deliver the blasting powder, they will wreak unknown havoc. They're doing powder. Well, they're not doing powder. That would result in something quite different, wouldn't it? This is not good at all. Seriously, please. There you go, that's one. I'm running out of arrows. What do I do if I run out of arrows? Oh, you cheeky. What? Don't. What? Oh, yeah, I forgot these things can jump up. No, 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 you cheeky prick. You're not allowed to deliver it. Now I'm just going to wait for the other one to be miles behind. Good job, Forrest. <laughs> Forest run! That blasting powder could even make short work of the walls of Minas Ethel. Did he just say, if you don't make a fucking game about Minas Tirith and Helm's Deep at this point, I'm gonna slap a bitch, because that is a game you need to make with this. Oh, the worst thing imaginable just happened. I'm out of arrows. What do I do? Like, no, really, what do I do? I need a rock. Do I only need to jump on you? Got you! Uh, do you... The blood, the blood spray was just astounding there. The blood spray was amazing. Do I get an explosion if I do this? Oh no. Oh! You know when I saw you on the captain feed and saw you all small and spindly? I didn't think there was anything unique about you, but you... Ooh! I wasn't expecting that. I am really quite happy. I'm really quite surprised. Now I know why you didn't have any bodyguards. Hello, Ashcam. Utcha, you don't want to speak to me, my boy. Oh, I've got to kill your beastie. That cat can be arranged. Well, or I can just uh, do that. That's just... Utch! Monster Slayer. Don't kill my bow. Fuck it, fine. I killed you all, it's only fair. Wow, how do you do? Oh, don't grab my fucking head of all the traits you could have had, you prick. There's nothing left between you and me now, is there? Good. I will carve you up and deliver your pieces to the corners of Mordor! Oh, fuck me, you're a man with a plan, aren't you? What's special about you, then? Because everybody else had something interesting about them. The last guy was immune to everything under the sun and his only weakness was his weapon. You, however, just seem to be rather healthy. Yeah, that's about it. You don't have anything interesting about you. I can literally just do this to you and I'll be completely fine. Oh, I almost feel bad. The last guy, the last two guys, in fact, held quite... Quite the record! The rule of men shall extinguish itself in a mighty blaze! You know, you're not too wrong! <laughs> you know, except for the part where we win in every shape, way, and form because Sauron's a fucking idiot. Who knows what catastrophes I've averted this day? Well, seeing as Helm's Deep still has blasting powder, not as much as you'd think. Did his head just fade through that fucking wall? Is Pennywise underneath that goddamn cinder just grabbing heads? They all float down here, Georgie. They all float. In a minute he's gonna ask me if I want a fucking balloon. I've been dreaming up ways to cut you down. Allow me to show you a few. Zathra. That's a hell of a name. Ooch! Well, that was mildly inconvenient. <laughs> For a moment, I thought you'd be a threat, you know, with the whole immune to range thing. If you were unable to be jumped over, you would have been quite the threat and problem. Maybe not a threat, just a pain in the ass, like a boil equaling me not be able to sit down. Ooch! That's just mean! I underestimated this time. That you did, Mr. Fowl. Now, time for Toppy Bye Bye! Challenger! Challenger? Seems to me that one of us should be afraid. And it can't be me, so pucker up. Okay, now if that's not a fucking come on, I don't know what the hell is. Seriously. 
puck her up? At least the other Oryx have the grace to at least mask it in some fancy fucking- Oh, you bastard! Oh, you're jumping toward me? Okay. <laughs> How'd that go for you? You seem to like jumping and we're right next to a bridge. You can probably guess where we're going. Ooh. Insult to injury, your men are carving you up along the way to your fall. Fall from grace. Fall from... bravery? Fall from a bridge! Oh! <laughs> Did you see the way he fell? He kind of nutted himself right on the corner of the wood, and that's not something a man should say to another. Good gravy. Oh! Well, I just got introduced to that wall and your fear quite immediately. Where the fuck are you going? Stop trying to run. Seriously, it's for your own good. You've got to learn to face your fear head on. It'll do you the world of good. Assuming that thing, you know, stays alive by the time I get there and my captain isn't on his knees? I should probably hurry up. Hey there, Grelgy boy. Brought you a little meal now. Eat it up. No, stop going for my guy. Hit the little shitty spindly prick. No, 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 but you can't. Hi there. Stay right the flying fuck nuggets there. Kill him, Grog. I presented a meal to you. Grog, this is right there. I've offered him to you as the bloody idiots on Skull Island would present a whore to King Kong. Eat him. Oh, the man with the fear just ran straight into a Grog. Is he meaning to do that? Because he's done it twice now. He's, he's, he's this Grog dead, this Grog dead. Uh, um, is he? He is. Yes, he is. Oh, he's not dead. Oh, he's doing it again. We can't win without the boss. Oh, well, uh, there were many things about that. <laughs> the legend was immune to the Grog for whatever reason. He executed... The captain was trying to flee from the Grog inside the corpse of him, realised that I couldn't see half of it, and decided to do it again. Uh, <laughs> Okie dokie, you really are quite living up to your name of the legend. Thank you <laughs> for that, I've seen you a grand total of one time after our original encounter, and you've made it amazing! You've made it more than memorable. That's a story I'll tell my grandchildren. Let's see what you've got.